When we first started meeting, there wasn't a lot. It was just camaraderie. It was getting together, getting to know each other, and extending that family out from just here in Arizona, but to the other regions across Kitchell. And then once that took root and we started getting more members in, then there was this innate, just organic desire to do something as a group. And that blossomed into the two events that we've had this year, which are the car show and the adopt a street program. And then of course our recruiting efforts on the bases in the areas in which we do work. Our goal with the car show was to gather as many veteran owned businesses, vendors to show up. So the food truck that showed up, Marine Corps veteran. Our vendors, we had Marine Corps veterans, we had Army, Air Force, and that was our primary goal. Um, the vibe I thought was pretty cool. I'm a car enthusiast myself. Uh, so I was super excited to see all the cars show up. Um, it was great to see former Kitchell employees I thought that was great. That just goes to show you the type of organization that Kitchell is. Um, they just build those long lasting uh, relationships. It was fun just to talk to everybody and look at what they have and uh, just see the presence and the support from the community and Kitchell. And we raised a, a nice chunk of change and the Gold Star Moms are really, really you know, grateful for what we did for them. And, um, you know, hopefully next year it'll be even bigger. I'd like to fill that whole parking lot up with cars. It'd be really cool. One of the first initiatives we did was the adopt a street. Um, we felt that was important to give back to the community. Uh, we've been doing that every quarter this year. Uh, and it's been a great success. In fact, we have a, a sign now, an adopt a street sign for Kitchell out there on uh, 12th Street. So it's, it's pretty neat. So the, the Kitchell Veterans Group is a great resource to assist with recruiting to help people through some of those transitional challenges that they may or may not yet realize that are going to exist as they make that transition into the public sector. It was very difficult for me to get, to get a job coming out of the Marine Corps uh, to the point where I couldn't get a job at Lowe's, Home Depot. I had to go to, I eventually got a job at a golf course. Um, and uh, the transition out of the Marine Corps was difficult for me. The whole purpose of our recruiting effort is to provide our veterans availability to anyone that we would bring on. There was a young man out in Texas when we were at Fort Hood that we were interested in. So we partnered him up with Pete Martinez, who's in Texas, who was an Army service member. And Pete took the time out to make a connection, to get to know him, and kind of help him through the pains of what's about to happen as you transition out because it's not a it's not apples for apples when you do that so that's really what the group is here to do is if there's a veteran that's interested in the industry and or is in the industry and wants to come across to us then we're here to help ease that transition anthony and i did a recruiting fair at fort hood which was pretty neat there was four thousand soldiers that came through this recruiting fair we talked to i can tell you how many at least five, six hundred soldiers that were getting out of the military. And um, I think we found a couple good candidates and it was, it was pretty neat to see that and do that because when I got out of the military, I never had that. It was like, here, we'll help you write a resume. And that was about it. To see all these companies supporting the veterans was really neat to see and, and Kitchell being part of that was nice. The Kitchell Veterans Group is open to anyone who has served and they really, it doesn't matter if you work at Kitchell or not. If you're a veteran that is looking to meet some great people, relive or reconnect with that brotherhood that we ex we've all experienced in the military, then we welcome you to our group. My name is Sean Campbell. I'm a veteran of the Marine Corps, and I was a Lance Corporal. Steve Crea, I was uh, in the Army, and I was a Specialist E4. Anthony Camacho. Master Gunnery Sergeant, United States Marine Corps. 